Hi, I'm Craig Sobin. I'm an engineer here at Triangle Tube. I'm going to show you how to set the combustion on a prestige boiler. Here I have a PA399, but this procedure also works on a PA299. What you need, two torque screwdrivers, a T40 and a T25, and a combustion analyzer. The combustion analyzer should read the oxygen in the room as 20.8 or 20.9%. If it doesn't, then it's out of calibration and it needs to get fixed before you set the combustion of the boiler. So the first thing we do, unscrew the vent port and plug in our test probe. Turn the boiler on. Once it powers on, press the installer button, push in the code 054. Press OK. Go right to the hand icon, manual operation. Press OK. And under fan, press OK. And press right all the way until it reaches 100%. Once that gets up to speed and the combustion analyzer adjusts, you can set the high fire. Our goal is 9.2% CO2 and less than 100 parts per million of CO as per stated in the install manual. All right, we just need to adjust our CO2 to reach 9.2. Our throttle screws were located right here. Turn it clockwise to increase, and then just wait for the combustion analyzer to catch up to our adjustments. All right, it seems to have settled at 9.2%, which is perfect. So now let's go and check low fire. On the menu, hit left on the fan and drop it down from 100% down to 1%. And wait a minute for the combustion analyzer to catch up to the adjustments. In the meantime, take your T40 screwdriver and remove the offset screw cap located right here. For our low fire, our goal is 8.7% as stated in our installation manual. We just need to make some slight adjustments for the offset screw. Turn it very slightly, each adjustment. Readings have settled at 8.7%, which is exactly where we want them. So let's go back to high fire and just make sure that nothing has changed. Again, make sure you're highlighting fan and press right until the bar reaches 100%. And it seems our combustion analyzer has settled on 9.2%, which is right where we left it. So we're all done. What we need to do is turn the fan off. So just press OK. It'll say released. That's how we know that test mode is off. Take out our test probe and reattach the vent test cover. Reinstall the offset screw cap. And then just put the cover back on the boiler and return it back to normal service. If you have any questions, please contact our tech support. You can find our phone number or email address at our website under contact us. Thank you.